everybody, I'm Ray. And I'm Paul. And we are the Alkanauts. And today, we take you down to the Rose City, down the historical path of the Welland Canal to a brewery that has been putting out some fantastic beers and relatively new to our region. Ray, give us the tale of the day. This week, we've got from Bridgewater Brewing in Welland, Ontario, Lift Bridge Light Lager, which comes in at 4.5% ABV. It promises to be crisp and clean and crushable. Let's crack these babies open and find out what's inside these cans. That is a translucent yellow. As Alan says, can you see my face? It smells lagery. It's got that slight cornish odor to it. <laughs> I know there's no corn in it, but I'm just saying. Let's get into this. Let's try it. Cheers, right? Cheers, everybody. If you want a crushable beer, then this is definitely your, your thing. Carbonation is a little higher than I would have liked. It's really light. This is definitely one of those sessionable beers you can have at the pub and just enjoy the night with a bunch of friends and not have to worry about the ABV content on this. See, I get bright when I drink it. That's, that's my first thought. It's really effervescent. There's a lot of flavor there, but then it disappears really quick. I, find I, it, I really like it. I find it kind of non-existent. I'm not trying to be that guy. That guy. It just seems like I'm I'm almost drinking. Oh God! I hate when people say this to me. I almost feel like I'm drinking water. Oh my! Yeah, I, I, see, I'm not there. I don't get that. I think on the crushable scale, it's it's the the crush factor has to be way up there. I'm not trying to crap on this beer. I would have thought with a a light beer, it just have a little bit more substance to it. Substance, yeah. Really. Yeah, I get where you're coming from. It's it's definitely lighter than I expected it would be. I should love this. I you really should. should. You absolutely really should, should love this. this. I feel bad now. You're a bad boy! It's, it's funny because I'm really enjoying it. I found lately I've gone back to craving traditional styles of beer done well. Okay, like they've made a light beer is a definitely a, a way to say to their you know target audience, you know, we got beers for everybody. Yep, exactly. exactly. I think they, I could be wrong here, but I think they've even got a seltzer that they make on site. Shut your mouth. Yes. But then uh, the wives can come. Yeah, my wife pref prefers beer to seltzer. Shut your mouth. <laughs> we are mature enough as a channel that we don't need shenanigans. Exactly. Then our very next one will yeah. be nothing but shenanigans. But today, we're going to mature this up and just count down. From three to two to one. Yeah. And when we say go, we go. We go. We go. Three, two, one. Go. <laughs> Son of a <laughs> I find the extra carbonation that's in this and how bubbly it is quite refreshing. So many beers lately I've found undercarbonated. I don't like undercarbonated beers. This was pretty high up there in the carbonation level. I just let out a huge burp. Uh. And the aftertaste I'm getting out of it is nothing. Is it flavorful? It's, it's not to my liking. Was it crushable? 100%. Is it a good beer? Is it a sessionable beer? A hundred percent. I would still buy like a case of this stuff. If you could just add a little bit more flavor, I'd be a happy guy. I like the really light flavor on this one. I like the fact that you drink it, it's there and then it's gone. You're not going to get tired of drinking this beer if that's what's available and there's nothing else. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a case of this too. A hundred percent. Good job Bridgewater Brewing and for I believe the absolute newest brewery in the Niagara region. Well done. And just to let you guys know, we have our new shirt of the month. So check out thealkanauts.com, buy some merch. And with that being said, I'm Paul. And I'm Ray. And we are the Alkanauts. Cheers, all. Take care.